This is going to be the best day in my entire life, finally going back to Disneyland in several years, and I get to go on my favorite rides again. I know Dave, I am also happy about going to Disneyland. We were supposed to go in 2020, but it was closed that year. Attention, passengers of flight, Southwest 1235, with service to Denver, continuing on to Los Angeles, the flight is delayed by an hour and 30 minutes. I repeat, for passengers of Southwest Airlines Flight 1235 to Denver, continuing on to Los Angeles, the flight is delayed by an hour and a half. Oh, no, you must be kidding me. This is not real. Oh great, here we go again. I know, right, Dad is going to act childish. I want to go to Disneyland. I want to ride the Casey Jr. train. I want to do all of those things so bad. For crying out loud, Dave, stop it. The flight is delayed, and there is nothing any of us can do about it. So stop throwing a tantrum like the big baby you always are, and learn to be patient. Is that something to ask for? But Catherine, I was looking forward to going to Disneyland, but now it's been ruined, because the stupid flight can't show up at the gate on time. Well, there is something I need to explain to you, so listen closely. There are some things that we cannot control. And besides, we are still going to Disneyland. It's just that we'll arrive in NM a little later than expected. And we're going to be there for a week. Can't you just go up to the desk and tell them to make the plane go faster so that it can arrive on time? No! Absolutely not. Why can't you do it for me, please? Who do you think I am, a Karen? No, now be patient. Great, this is beyond embarrassing. I know, it's one thing Dad behaves like a baby at home, but it's another thing that he acts like this in public. What is going through his mind? Wait a minute, where do you think you're doing, Dave? Is there anything I can help you with today? Yes, I demand that you make the plane fly faster so that it shows up at the gate on time. Sir, that is something I cannot control. All I know is that the plane took off from LaGuardia Airport 15 minutes ago. No, I want you to talk to the pilot and make the plane fly faster. You need to do your job correctly. Besides, I think your computer is running Windows 1.0, or something. All of the computers at the airport are running Windows 10, but will be upgrading to Windows 11 soon. And I cannot speak directly to the pilots, because I am only a gate agent. Only air traffic control can communicate with the pilot. I know you have a microphone, and you can communicate with air traffic control. I demand you speak with air traffic control, so that they can make the plane fly faster. Sir, you need to learn some patience. No, you need to learn to do your job correctly. Can I speak to your manager? Here we go, now dad is acting like a Karen. His behavior has only gotten worse recently. I know, right? If he keeps acting like this, we may end up being thrown out of the airport terminal. Look, sir, you don't tell me how to do my job. Keep up this behavior and I will get airport security to deal with you. All right, you asked for it. Temper tantrum in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Why, why can't I get the flight to arrive on time? This is so not fair. The world revolves around me, and you all should know that. Why? Well, I think this behavior is very embarrassing in front of everyone in the terminal. And some people almost miss their flights because they were focusing on what's going on over here. I bet your pardon? You heard me right. 
a grown man acting like a big baby, kicking and screaming on the floor. That has got to me the most embarrassing thing I have ever seen in my life. Now listen here, cow. My husband has problems, and he cannot help it sometimes. So why don't you leave us alone and mind your own business? Seriously, if I had a husband who acted like a baby, I would have him taken to a mental hospital. Wow, just unbelievable, who does that woman think she is? You're not going to have me put into a mental hospital, are you, Catherine? No, you're not going to a mental hospital, however, it's about time that you start acting more grown up, especially while out in public. Okay, I promise that I will act more mature from now on. Alright then, why don't we go have lunch somewhere while we're waiting for the flight? Because it's good to do things while waiting for something else. And before we have lunch, the reason my voice briefly changed earlier in the video is because for some reason, the Catherine voice wasn't working properly in the on studio these last couple of days. But now all the voices are working properly. Before we go to the restaurant, I also have to say that my voice also changed for a short time in the video, but it's good to find out that the problem was fixed. I'm also glad that situation was fixed, and especially now that you're not going to act like a big baby anymore, and I don't have to call airport security after all. With that said, Dave, where would you like to have lunch? Let's go to Burger King, because I always wanted to get a happy meal. Oh, no, there's a very long line at this restaurant. Make the people in front of me move faster so that we can order our food. Why? Well, is this how the rest of the day is going to be like, after you promise not to act childish anymore? I have a feeling this is going to be a long day, and I also think dads will even act childish while we're on the flight to Los Angeles. This trip is not going to be that enjoyable. Why did we even plan to go to Disneyland? <laughs>